YNR Thursday Preview, Ashley's Shocking Dual Identity Revealed Tucker's Obsession Unveiled Audra Fights for Love Watch Ashley's alter ego emerge, leaving everyone stunned. As Tucker dives deeper into Ashley's mystery, Audra takes matters into her own hands, ready to battle for Tucker's heart. Plus, Sally's advice sparks Audra's determination. Can Tucker choose between Ashley's secrets and Audra's love? Find out the shocking truth unfold on the young and the restless. Hello everyone, welcome to my channel, I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. After watching these videos, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Audra is prodded to fight by Sally, and Tucker tackles Ashley's mental puzzle. Ashley Abbott will only say great things about Abby Newman official Abbott's board seat in the Young and the Restless previews for Thursday and March 14. Ashley doesn't appear all that interested, and Abby will soon understand this, leading her to wonder if Ashley is just thinking about Tucker McCall. But since Abby has already spoken her opinion, Ashley will insist on ending the conversation about Tucker once and for all. Watchers will be able to hear Ashley thinking like someone else at one point in Thursday's YNR show, which will confirm that she has multiple personalities. Aw, Ashley's daughter is such an a asterisk asterisk hole. The inquiries, the inquiries, the inquiries concerning Tucker, this alternate identity will ruminate to herself. She will be eager to tidy up this mess while she downs a glass of wine so Ashley can return to her nosy, irritating family. Abby will question whether her mother's claim that she wasn't at the GCAC to see Tucker last night was accurate after Ashley says she needs to return to the lab. Ashley will insist on being trusted and present the impression that her relationship with Tucker is fine. When Tucker gets back upstairs to his suite, Audra Charles will be packing for Paris with excitement. When Tucker claims that the trip must be postponed due to business, Audra will assume that Ashley is the real target and will get into a fight. Tucker will storm out on Audra, pointing out that trust concerns ruined his relationship with Ashley. He won't want to go through this with her again. When Audra loses it and starts to hurl things off the bed, she'll go to Crimson Lights and run into Sally Spectra. Audra will accept Sally's invitation to sit with her at a table so they may discuss their convoluted love lives. After Audra tells Sally about some of her problems with Tucker, Sally will say that it's occasionally worthwhile to struggle for a once-in-a-lifetime love. It will seem like Audra needs to put up more of a battle for what she has with Tucker from Sally's point of view. When Ashley returns, she will see Tucker at the fitness center and find out that the trip to Paris has been rescheduled. Ashley won't accept the business-related justifications either, believing that Tucker is remaining in the area as a result of her. Tucker will accompany Ashley to the jazz lounge, where she'll remark that she's craving an old-fashioned and question if it's too early for a cocktail. Tucker will have valid concerns about Ashley's behavior, given her drink selection and her impulsive, hostile demeanor. Ashley will give off the impression that she has recently realized her goals and offer the suggestion that, in order to win Tucker over, she should try becoming more like him. Tucker will continue to be doubtful and believe Ashley is confused, even though she will argue that this is about making up for what she messed up. Ashley will say Tucker has to make it seem like she has mental health problems because he can't acknowledge he loves her. Tucker will argue that if there is a serious issue and he contributed to it, then he should assist Ashley. Naturally, Ashley would argue that nothing is wrong and that all she wants is for things to return to how they were. Tucker will laugh at Ashley when she acts as though she would abandon her family in a heartbeat this time. Ashley would argue that she destroyed everything and that she regrets it sincerely, but she also promises that it won't happen again. Ashley will give Tucker a kiss when he asks whether he should simply believe her. Daniel Romilotti Jr. will update Heather Stevens at Society about his talk with Lily Winters and how he may have been a little too honest when he said he loved Heather forever. He'll say that working together will be interesting after Heather and Daniel get home, but he'll think they can manage it like grown-ups.
In order to avoid upsetting Lily, Daniel and Heather will declare that they would no longer be hiding their relationship from the public, with the exception of Chancellor Winters. Lily will approach Devin Hamilton Winters at work, questioning how he managed to remain silent about Daniel's betrayal of Heather. Lily will feel compelled to strike out at Devin and Daniel as well, even if she is trying to be calm. Devin will apologize and clarify that he was just trying to keep Lily from having too much turmoil already. Eventually, Lily will confess that she's actually genuinely sorry about the whole thing rather than angry at Devin. Lily's reunion with Daniel will be essentially ruined by the revelation that he has never stopped loving Heather, but she will push her hurt aside in order to concentrate on her career. Devin, Lily, and Abby will talk about Mamie Johnson's proposal to split the businesses, which would make the merger a symbolic one. Devin will basically say that a catastrophe is about to occur and make a statement about Lily returning at the best worst time possible. Stay tuned for more predictions on Lily's ability to pull it off in the upcoming episodes of The Young and the Restless, as spoilers indicate she will demonstrate that she is no pushover. The next update for today. Summer and Kyle's urgent meeting, Adam and Chelsea prioritize family. Spoilers for Friday, March 15's episode of The Young and the Restless indicate that Summer Newman will put her co-parenting challenge on hold and step away from her enjoyable little bubble with Chance Chancellor. It appears that Summer and Kyle Abbott will meet urgently to discuss Harrison Abbott and a family dilemma. Fans of Young and the Restless are aware that Harrison has had a lot going on lately, beginning with Summer's move out of the Abbott house. Harrison was already having trouble when his cherished nanny left town indefinitely to assist her sick mother, as he had informed Tracy Abbott that he missed Summer's time there. If Harrison has been behaving out, Kyle and Summer may need to talk about some new behavioral concerns. In their quest to make Harrison's life as comfortable as possible, Summer and Kyle might also discuss potential nanny substitutes. In any event, Summer and Kyle will demonstrate that they are able to work together as co-parents. It sounds like Summer and Kyle will do whatever it takes to prioritize Harrison. On Friday's YNR episode, Chelsea Lawson and Adam Newman will share the same objective as they prioritize their family with Connor Newman. Connor was just diagnosed with OCD, so Adam and Chelsea will be there to support him while he adjusts to the news. Although Connor's journey ahead won't be simple, he will have lots of love and support throughout his path. Tucker McCall will then hear from Audra Charles that she won't give up on their future without a fight. Following Sally Spectra's suggestion, Audra will make it plain that she isn't prepared to give up. But based on our most recent projections, Tucker's obsession with Ashley Abbott is likely to remain an issue. Tucker may put Ashley's mental health above his romance with Audra as he is starting to show genuine concern for her. According to previews for The Young and the Restless, Tucker will keep looking into Ashley's situation, so check back for details on how he discovers his dual identity. Thanks for watching this videos. Please hit the subscribe button for more updated news.